Hi guys, how's it going? Uh, I'm making this video just to show you my new LED light setup. Um, this is for the moonlighting, so if you want to check it out, um, just watch my previous video and that's what it looks like at night. Um, it's daytime now, so I just wanted to show you how it's been built. Um, I didn't actually build it myself, my dad did it for me, but I can show you the basics of what he did. Um, so you can probably make it yourself if you ever want to do something like that. Um, it's relatively simple and cheap, so yeah, I'll just show you what it is. Basically, it's a sort of an angled plastic tube pipe thing. It's not really a tube since it's not circular. Um, but um, yeah, I think you can get these from Bunnings or just, I don't know, any sort of hardware store um, where you can get building supplies and stuff like that. I'm not exactly sure what this is previously used for, but we just had it lying around, so we thought we might as well make use of it. Um, basically, it's just got some little slits cut into it here. Um, so it can sit on the glass on both sides and that sort of gives you the option to move it back and forward if you want to. You can have it at the front here as well, but I decided to have it at the back. Um, I'm thinking to actually spray it silver um, to match my light as well, but I haven't gotten around to that yet. So yeah, basically it's just a piece of plastic. Um, it's very light, so there's no need to worry about it, you know, falling in or anything. Um, and it's just got a strip of adhesive LEDs on it. Um, you can get these for about $20 for a 5 meter roll, I think. Um, and you can actually cut them up and separate them um, into the length you want. So this is probably about 60 centimeters. So um, you've still got a heap left over if you want to use it for something else. Um, but one thing you do have to be aware of is that once you do cut it, you can't actually use the adapter that it comes with, I think. Um, you have to, you know, just wire it up here um, by yourself and use a separate adapter, I guess. Um, but other than that, yeah, it's a cheap DIY option if you're looking for some moon lighting or some LED lighting for your um, aquarium. Um, it does have some little wire supports here that we've tied down and you can actually just push these back um, into the folded part. Um, that's just to stop the LEDs from falling in. We weren't sure if um, it would sort of overheat and then drop in but we want it to be safe so just put those on there but I felt it this morning and it wasn't hot at all so um, depends on how high you have the LED set to um, also depends if you'll need to support it in any way um, but basically that's what it is so yeah not much else I can tell you guys apart from that this actually comes with this roll of LEDs actually comes with um, a remote like this um, it's a little bit dark in here but I can sort of show you um, it's also it's also in its plastic, so it might be a bit reflective. Um, here you've got your brightness up and brightness down, I think. Um, off, on, obviously. You've got your color um, options because you can actually change the color of these LEDs. If you watch my video, two videos back from this one, I think, um, it's got the color phases that the LEDs go through. Um, basically, you've got red, orange, yellow, green. Um, blue, purple, and then a sort of pinkish color. Um, what else is on here? Oh, you can actually change what the LEDs do. There's a flash setting, a strobe setting, a fade setting, and a smooth setting, which I think is what the um, color phase one is in that video that I was telling you about. So basically, yeah, I don't know how much this um, cost. I think it actually came with the roll, so probably about $20 with the five meters of LEDs. And basically that's what it's looking like. So if you have any questions, leave them below. Um, as I said, I didn't actually build it myself, so I can't give you all the details. But if you have a particular question, I can probably ask my dad and find out. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll talk to you guys later.